This video was considered a definitive source for the design of the Project 18 destroyer. It was supposed to be the Indian equivalent to the Chinese Type 055, which along with the South Korean Sejong the Great Class are the most potent warships in production. This design was surely above the 10,000 ton threshold, and if you pause at the right times you can see that it has at least 120 if not 144 VLS cells. It was seen as a great equalizer towards a Chinese navy running away with numbers of very advanced ships, and a clear step forward in Indian navy capability. This video came out in October of 2022 and till now has been seen as a definitive source of info on the Project 18. But, something interesting happened. On the 11th of July 2023, I was tagged in this post which was very interesting. The first image with the white background is a picture of the Italian DDX concept. The Italian design was unveiled in 2021. It is a 175 meters long, 11,000 tons empty, and up to 13,500 tons loaded. They have eight Tessio anti-ship missiles plus 64 VLS cells across six Sliver A-50 modules amidships for SAM, and two Sliver A-70 modules in front of the bridge for scalp cruise missiles. It was supposed to be an oversized destroyer with massive endurance, just like the newly proposed German 9,000-ton frigate design. It totally slipped under my radar and I hadn't heard about it until this tweet brought it up. The Indian design was released in a video dated October 2022, so almost a year after the Italian DDX was shown off. Let us do a side-by-side -side comparison of the Italian DDX and the supposed Indian Project 18. Now I want you all to take your time and zoom into the screen and try to see the details I am going to point out. I am going to start from front of the ship, towards aft of the ship. Let us first go over similarities. Look at the bow lines before the 4 VLS, they are identical. The gun placements are identical too, and are marked in red. The shape of the bridge matches. There seem to be angled box launchers behind the bridge and primary radar marked in orange. The exhaust stacks match, as marked in green. The shape of the entire superstructure minus the primary radar matches. It just looks shorter in height on the Indian ship from the video. Now the differences. The main radar is very different. The Italian design has two VLS modules 4, and six VLS modules amidships for a total of eight. Indian vessel seems to have nine modules 4, and maybe six or nine modules amidships. No secondary radar on the Indian design beside aft stack marked in green. The boathouse is a beam with amidships VLS bank on the Italian design, it is slightly forward in the Indian vessel. Now you ask. Is the Indian Project 18 destroyer related to this design? Without a doubt, they are too similar to think that they are not related. Now, how India got the design is what I don't know. Maybe it was shared during joint work between the naval design teams of the two countries. We know that INS Vikrant's design had some Italian touches which are pretty evident. It is also possible that this Project 18 we see is entirely fake, and someone picked up the Italian design and made a fictional Indian P-18 based on it. We have to wait and watch to see how this turns out. Until next time, this was Epsilon.